All right, you guys. So another modification, you'll notice that the newsletter's tactical and practical. So I got these awesome tactical bags. I left the tag on here, not to be like mini pearl, but so I could just tell you all about them. XG Gamma bags for a JL, which is the type of Jeep Wrangler that I have. And they're from XG Cargo. And what I love is look, they fit into this space here. They come with this amazing metal, um, rod that mounts right onto the Jeep and then has these additional um, pulls to really cinch it down. And they're called tactical yeah. bags because they open up. I think they're practical bags because look at all this extra storage that I have here, which is amazing. And I think these are probably one of my favorite modifications because there's two of them. So you get this like great story. So I wanted to give you a view from the outside, right? So you can see Teddy's toy clearly because play is important, but these things are amazing and they, they mount right onto the bar, the frame that is underneath the, the hard top. And they give me so much more storage. And then you probably haven't seen like all of this because I've just been so busy and it's been so cold. So the tactical part of this, as I showed you before, was that I have all of this amazing storage here underneath the bed platform, as well as underneath the upper portion of the bed platform. But I knew that I was going to be doing a lot of cooking in this area right here with the front runner table. So I wanted to have some places where I could have like easy access to things, either without having to open the bottom or with just being able to open this, this window and, and grab those things, but also have awesome storage while I'm in there. So I think that's pretty much the tactical part as well as pretty practical in the sense of storage is key. And speaking of storage, I'll show you my other practicality. So you guys have been on this journey with me, I feel like from the get go. And I wanted to show you pretty much everything that goes into a one bedroom apartment is right here, excluding larger pieces of furniture. But I did keep the bed, my bed frame, my custom headboard, all those kinds of things. And what this does is it allows me to just kind of have that mental safety net of, hey, if I don't like this Jeep life thing or van life in the Jeep, then I have this way to install myself into a studio or one bedroom apartment pretty rapidly with all of the comforts as if though it was just a short vacation. However, I know that this is going to go on for a little while. So this is me being practical. All right. Enjoy the rest of the newsletter. May your new year be full of blessings, full of love, and most importantly, full of joy. I'll see you soon. Bye.